What's up, my daughter ass gang? What's up, my grub hug gang? This is your boy Kingfish, aka Big Al, coming at you with another video. What it do, what it do, family? It's a late video today, guys, man. Whew. I had a rough day yesterday. I went in, I had to be to work at, uh, cause I'm doing vacation relief for one of the workers who, you know, I have to do his job when he's gone. And he went on vacation during our busiest week. We got so much going on in Tampa that Coca-Cola had to host everything and sponsor everything. Man, went in at 11.30. Had to be there at 12, so I got there a little bit before 11.30. Didn't get off till 6.30 this morning, guys. 6.30 this morning. 20-hour day, man. Oh, man. The rest of the crew came in at 2. But we had a lot of people out. We had a lot of people on vacation. It was just uh, poorly planned. So I started dashing at 10 o'clock. I did four orders. Uh, I had wifey with me, you know. If I'm starting at 10 o'clock, she coming. So I didn't get a chance to, uh, you know, record anything. But I wanted to make this short video, guys. Uh, just let y'all know. I appreciate all the love that y'all and support that y'all showed Bakari. He needed that. You know what I mean? Family stick together, man. Pray together, stay together. You feel me? So I appreciate your family members for doing that. Continue to wish him some good words, man. He needed it right now. One thing we don't want him to do is um, claim depression. Talk for T. Thank you for the prayer. We really, we really need that spiritual wisdom on the page. Thank you for giving him them chapters. I'm going to have to look them up for myself, too. You feel me? So I already had my 10 for the day, Trini. I don't kill that. But um, I go in today at 3. I'm hurting. I got some rest. i tell you what, I can tell you this. I got home a little bit before 7. I said hi to the wife, gave the wife a kiss, and that's all I remember. Out. I lay across the bed. Boom, gone. All I heard was, I know you better get your butt in the shower. <laughs> Still have my shoes on, fam. Still have my shoes on. She was out there doing something in the kitchen. I said, I'm going to just lay here for a second. Gone. Instant. I said, I wish I could fall asleep like that every day, man. I get in bed thinking I'm good to go to sleep, man. Next thing I'm, uh, I'm up four or five hours later. Like I got a second or third win. But yeah, I had some good orders this morning. I had a uh, Boston Market. I had a Walmart that was only 18 items. It was like $9.88. I had a Ruben Cuban. And what else I had? Boston Market, Ruben Cuban. Walmart and was one more Bob Evans so I made a quick 50 bucks I'm happy like I said 10, 11, 12 uh, less than two and a half hours you might as well say right now I'm going to get some air Hope my girl ain't up here because I don't feel like messing with her today. She cut my eye off today, guy. I'm going to show up and show out. You know when you're tired and just the smallest thing bothers you? I was sitting at the light and this this bird, I mean, just, just, just came and just sat right on the front of the car like it's an animal. While I'm at the light, no. It wasn't a crow or nothing Because that probably would have been, been a bad sign But it was a nice little blue jay Nice beautiful bird So I just looked at him He looked at me I was like you don't get the hell off my hood <laughs> He was like what you gonna do player So I, I bumped the car a little bit He just kept his balance I said oh this bird want me to get out the car So make a long story short He ain't want no problem as soon as I start moving, he jumped off the car. And my wife kept saying, leave that bird alone. That bird was about to get it. You 
feel me? I was gonna go get my bat. <laughs> oh man. Family, the day is keeping it real Monday, so I gotta keep it real. And on Mondays, after I have a long day on Sundays, I always pray that the boss don't ask me nothing about Sunday. You know, thank God the manager, he came in. You know, big up to him. A lot of respects, dude. He came in and stayed all night long with us. You know. But the big boss, I always pray that he don't ask me uh, what happened last night or how it went. Cause you know I gotta keep it real, you know. And I'm, I'm, I'm so sure not gonna keep it real. <laughs> it's just uh, too much work for the crew that we had, but we got it done. So I want to thank my crew that came in last night, man. I got a lot of love for you guys. Thank you guys for showing up, showing out. We did a good job. We did a job of uh, 40 people. 20-something people did a job of 40-something people, you know? So I was able to get an extra day for this day. Wish I could have got paid for it, but you know, a paid day off is okay with me. I am not a greedy person. I am blessed to have a job. I take all the perks that comes with it. Yep, there she go. I hope she don't, oh jeez. She already out here smiling. Did she go back, oh she went back in. I know she gonna mess with me, she always do. She's undefeated. She done, she told me she done beat up every man in her life. So I'm gonna try not to make her get any more Wins underneath her belt. So I ain't gonna fool with her. Now it's starting to rain when I go get it. what you call. But I'm glad it's raining because I'm about to lay down. I gotta be to work at 345 today. Boss told me come in late. I'm coming in late. You ain't gotta worry about me. I'm one of them good I'm one of them guys that listen. He said be there at 345, I will be there at 344. <laughs> <laughs> That's early. One minute is early. I don't care what nobody say. Yep. The only way I can get my wife to be somewhere early is I got to give her a two-hour start. So if we got to be there at 10 o'clock, I tell her we got to be there at 8 o'clock. That way we'll get there at 10 o'clock. Y'all know, women know what y'all do. All right, family. I'll be right back. i get some air real quick. I'm back, family. She didn't cut the air off for me, but while I was putting the air in my tire, I turned around, she was standing there. I said, what are you trying to get your first loss? <laughs> trying to get your first defeat? She's like, King Fish, you see that river over there? That's where they gonna find you at. You ever think about messing with me? I'm trying to get on camera. She would not let me get on camera. She said, let me go for you, try to get me. Nice old lady, man, nice old lady. I try to meet people wherever I go, man. Oh. I got my Jordan slippers on. I had these slippers. My daughter gave me these slippers um, a long, 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 long time ago. But they're so comfortable. It's funny because my wife wanted to throw them away. Every time I take my feet out, my slippers, they roll over. I'll be like, good puppy, good puppy, roll over, baby. You know, that. You know, I'm sorry, they're on the lean. <laughs> I can take both of my feet out at the same time and they'll roll over. <laughs> so every day I got to hide my slippers because my wife want to throw them away. They just come from, you know what I mean? She said they just disgusting. They don't look bad, you know. It's just in Florida you don't need tennis shoes. I wash, I wash my slippers. I put a suit on and put my slippers on. That's how comfortable these suckers are. They like they. I call them my penny loafers. Y'all remember the penny loafers? Back when I was little, right? I gotta tell y'all this. Back when I was little, my uncles used to wear penny loafers. And, um, you know, penny adds up. We had penny candy lady. 
And I used to always take this two pennies out his penny loafers and go get me two pieces of candy. And he he always get mad, but he's like, who the hell took my two my pennies out my penny loaf? You know, I played dumb. Like, mm -hmm. I don't even know how to spell penny. <laughs> Every time he put two pennies in there, I go get it. Yeah, I was bound to get about eight cents out of him a week. Yeah. I'm goofy right now, guys. So my tip for the day for you, YouTube, my YouTube family, is please be aware of your surroundings. Uh, when I was dashing today, uh, I pull up into uh, this is my Boston Market. I pull up in this um, area. It was it wasn't a bad area, but I noticed this guy kept watching this woman. He looked like he wanted to snatch her purse, but she wasn't paying no attention. He kept walking. You know, he was walking out, so I blew the horn so she turned around and see him. But, ladies and gentlemen, please be so aware of your surroundings, keep your head on the swivel. You know, there's a lot of people out here with bad intentions, and um, I don't want to see nobody or read about anybody, especially my dashing family. So, please make sure that you be aware of your surroundings, even though you've been in that neighborhood, you go to that neighborhood a hundred times. Always be aware of people that look suspicious. Not saying everybody is suspicious. Just be aware of your surroundings. I think he was trying to get her purse. See, every time she would look, he would move this way so he couldn't see it. But me and my wife, we just sitting there. I said, look at this fool. I think he's trying to get her purse. So I blew the horn, BB. She turned around. Then he just walked around the other way. So I knew that's what he was trying to do. So my tip today, guys, please be aware of your surroundings. I'm a little goofy right now. I had a 20 hour day. Let's see. So we'll start at 12 noon. 12. I had an 18 hour day today. 18 and a half hour day today. You know? For yesterday. I went there at 12 and got off at 6.30. So I pray that nobody call out today. I really do. But Coke can't keep running these people out, man. This Popo is about his job. He up here every day. I'ma play that number, 5424. That's the cop car number that I always send up here. 5424. All right, family, I'm giving y'all a number. If you play number 5424, if you hit, we split. <laughs> you like that? I just made it up. We hit, we split. Same hit. Alright, family. If you don't know, the day is keeping it real Monday. Your boy Kingfish is done for the day. I just want to make this video so I can keep my promise to a friend of mine that I made. One video a day. You know? Keep the frown away. Balls. <laughs> I can't even do no shout outs. I apologize to the ones that commented on the video. I just I just commented back today. I was so busy yesterday, man, I couldn't even I couldn't even give no comments out. But I appreciate everybody that left a message and I appreciate everybody that's looking at my boy Bakari, giving him some choice, you know, some very encouraging words. I can't even talk. I'm tired, fam. I'm about to go get me some rest. I'm going to upload this video. I apologize that you don't have it already. But family, I love you. Take it easy. Both eyes is about to close up. I got to be to work at 345. So I'm going to give me two hours of rest. All right, family, I love you. This is your boy, Kingfish, a.k.a. Big Al. I'm out, guys. If you're dashing, keep dashing. If you're grubbing, keep grubbing. If you're not dashing, you're not grubbing, you better get yourself some dashing grub, man. Peace, family. I love you. Pray that I make it through this week. Talk to you later.